dudes and dudettes, welcome back to Demo Doomsday. Uh, last we played Rotastic, which was a pretty solid game. Uh, nothing too bad. Um, I was enjoying myself. Uh, maybe didn't finish it completely, but uh, I think we saw enough of it to appreciate what it was, whatever it was. Uh, so on to the next one. Eh. Let's get Donnie set up here. All right. And blah, 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 Hidden in plain sight, they say. Okay, let's give it a go. Um, let's see, game details? Probably not. This looks like another one of those hidden hidden gems of an Xbox arcade game where uh, just some random scrub made it, put it on Xbox Live, and Xbox Live, as we all know, doesn't have any type of filter system for these type of games. So yeah, sure, put whatever you're putting on my hard drive. Uh, already we got a skeleton hitting on some lady with no forehead. Uh, we have a guy with a gun. Uh, we have the G-Sun. A giant with a flaming head, a very surprised Trojan warrior, and a ninja. Um, more ninjas. Uh, Mohawk man getting a hand job from the king. Let's do it! <laughs> it's loading. Okay. Oh! Ninja party. F okay, find yourself, kill other players, touch all five statues, press Y for a smoke bomb. Oh, this is like, uh, I think there's another game that came out like this recently. Actually, catch a thief, find yourself, collect coins, don't get shot. Snipers, discover and shoot thieves, use Y to mark the innocent. Yeah, this is exactly like that game that came out. Death race, race to the finish line. <laughs> Walk, run, shoot. Well, we gotta play all of these. Um, unless. Oh, are you kidding me? It's one of those. What, can I at least do race? Man! Well, that's bullshit. <laughs> what, 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 who would have guessed a, uh, a demo that requires me to have multiple people here to play? God damn it. Well, how am I gonna try the demo unless I have other fr I just can't wrap my head around that concept. It's like, hey guys, got this demo, should try it out. I guess that makes sense. Well, fuck that. That was lame. It's not the first one. It's not going to be the only one either. Uh, that's okay though, because that means we get to pick another one. Eh. All right. Get my headphones out of here. Make sure everything's recording still. That would have been that would have been terrible. All right, and blah 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 blah. Pimp RPG. Fuck yeah, this is more what I'm talking about. We're gonna be a pimp. We're gonna level up either ourselves or our bitches. And yes, be warned, the word bitches is gonna be thrown around a lot now because it's pimp RPG. Let's do it. <laughs> and if you couldn't tell, another one of those non AAA company type games. Select a controller by pressing either A or B. Yes or no. No. The fuck was that? Uh, this is gonna be one of those ones where I need to look at the controllers. It looks pretty self-explanatory, even though drop gear is. Oh no. 
not applicable is right stick. Okay, thanks for thanks for letting me know. No hoes were harmed during the making of this game. Oh my god, it's already gonna be a classic. I can tell. I can feel it coming through the air tonight. Oh lord. Uh, the mayor hasn't been seen for a while, and the streets are in trouble. Find the mayor and see if you can help him get back to helping the people in the city. Current jobity job. Go and speak to Queen Matifa. Help the good people. Just get back. Statistics. I'm Daddy K. I'm a warrior. Oh, that's kind of cool. I got a weapon which looks like a pipe. My defense is 15.16 with, or is it supposed to be 15 to 16 with just a plain old t-shirt, even though I'm clearly wearing a jacket, whatever. Uh, this is my equipment, items, junk quests, all the shit. Alright, help the good people. Okay, I'm doing it. We're helping. Guys, okay. Why are we helping the mayor? Queen Matifa. Ultimately, you need to find the mayor and see if you can help save the good people of the city. Quest complete. Pinstripe pants. Your first job, any job, is to find platinum grills for Queen Matifa. She will loan you her pinstripe pants in return. Oh, yeah. Defense up. Uh, platinum grills. Current job, any job. Look for a nearby stash bag that contains the platinum grills. Make sure you take care of Mayor West. Already, again, like I said, this game is a winner. Got some cash, got a health file. Signs tell me to go this way. <laughs> Look at all those bushes, man. This place, this game's got a lot of bush. Okay. Hi, I'm Trixie. I'd like to help you clean up the streets. Great, let's go. I got Trixie on my team. Better get into a fight. Careful going east, says Big Jim. Why is that Big Jim? And why can't I go east right now? Oh, somebody over here. Trixie's higher level than me. <sighs> my hose can't be higher than my pimp. Have you been down south? Multiple times. It's a bit of a personal question though. Uh, VJJ. Ha <laughs> ha Uh... She says, welcome to Fruitvale. I'm surprised with characters named Trixie and VJJ. They went with a town name called Fruitvale. Whatever. Um, is there a run button? No? Great. One out of ten. This game sucks. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This game's awesome. I got a gummy bear. It looks like I'm getting, like, injections of some design. Syringes, if you will. Welcome. Enjoy your stay. A healing inn. 20 gold? Well, I have money. How much does 80 bucks give me for gold? What's the exchange rate on gold right now? Welcome to World of Healing. Please enjoy... No. Gummy Bear restores targets magic points. <laughs> See, they had a good idea going on, but then they sort of just kind of gave up halfway through, didn't they? Also, from how the world map looks, it feels like I should be a lot shorter than this. I feel like I'm a giant walking amongst your typical RPG maker map. Ugh, got a lot of money. Checking my recording again. Because again, wouldn't want to miss all of this. I want to see my stats. Hold on. What does Trixie got? Trixie? Tri tri Trixie. Oh, there she goes. She's got a paintbrush, maybe. She also has a t-shirt and sneakers! Oh, fuck. Trixie's my tank. Oh, she's a wizard, never mind. That's like her wand. What magic spells? Spellbook. Minor heal. Throw the shoe. And throw my panties. I can't find the button to get the description on those. Otherwise, you know this would be great. Lucinda, I can help you with your mission to help the people of the city. Great, I'm sure I can help. Well, you just said you could, so. Oh, fuck! Ah, Lucinda, no. Why are you so gigantic, Lucinda? Oh my god. And also, Daddy K is just 
dancing his, his life off, his, his little, dance his little, little t-shirt off. Thug, street guy, and thug. Uh, let's do a melee attack on a street guy. He's got a different name, so maybe he's a bigger deal. Spell, let's throw the shoe. Let's do street guy again. Yes, that's what I'm talking about, Trixie. Uh, can you do spells, Lucinda? No. Are you like a, uh, gummy bears? It's weird. Weird name for a drug. Uh, s just stomp on that guy. Oh my god, she's gigantic. She also kicked ass. Did she just do 30? Did I read that right? Holy fuck. She's level 5, yeah. Well, yeah, I also should probably pay attention to the health. Uh, thug. Let's see if we want to hit a thug. No. I have a weapon equipped. I thought I'd be able to see it. No. Throw, throw, throw my panties. Oh, it hits everybody. Nice. Good job. Okay, Lucinda. Do your, do your bad thing. 28. Yeah, Lucinda's a badass. Holy shit. Still haven't killed anybody yet. Also, I can't help but notice that the music is strangely absent. Yeah. I think I just did two damage there. Why do you suck so bad, Daddy K? Let's see if we can throw a shoe and kill him. Yeah, there we go. And then Lucinda finishes the job. Finish him. Health file. Spell upgrades. Nothing. Okay, what do you want? Peace Cemetery is west of here. Peace Cemetery. What the hell? Uh, where all those guys on the map there are bad. Oh, Trixie! You killed my hoe and he just threw a stiletto at me. It's weird. Uh, shit. Is there like a phoenix down? Restores targets health points. Restores some. 80 health points. I don't have like a phoenix down thingy. Okay, let's go. Some hit points. 40. Oh, time expired. I fucking hate time expired demos. Why would you do this to me? All right. Well, unfortunately, I'm actually impressed. I didn't think a game called Pimp RPG. Wait, is that what it was called? Uh... A Pimp RPG, um, which is weird because the title clearly just says Pimp RPG. I didn't think a game called Pimp RPG would disappoint me, you know, like even in a stand, like at the standpoint of a bad game, like it was worse than what I expected. Is that weird? It was really weird. So I was like, the concept at least would have been really clever, you know? You have an RPG, but it's a pimp and his hoes, you know? But instead of health potions, you get, you know, drugs or what have you and you know typical weapons like swords and axes will be you know pipes and guns and stiletto heels and shit like that but no it like magic and also the fact that one of my ladies was a fucking giant um the map was uh, ugly as hell like it wasn't even very much street looking it was like a desert <laughs> with street going through it I don't know I didn't like it it was really bad and again for a game called pimp RPG that's saying something to disappoint me that badly because um, my expectations were low but it somehow topped it so yeah that was pimp RPG buy it for a dollar why not oh yeah let's see yeah apparently Nadia or loose set Paulatina, whatever her name was. Apparently she, yeah, is just a giant. I thought maybe she was in the foreground. She was just poorly rendered. But no, she's a, what? <laughs> How do they think this is okay? Do you see that lady? I'm pointing like a jackass. There's a giant lady. You can't even see her body. Look at that. Hold on. I'm going to go full screen. Yeah, top left there. What the fuck's going on? And again, look at that map. That's horrible. Like the background for the fight. That's pretty cool. I don't know. I kind of wished it was more. Um, 
here we go. This is what I was talking about before with these type of games, um, these type of demos. If it's like some indie developed thing, it'll classify it with violent sex and mature content. But it just blows my mind how some of this happens. Like violence one out of three. Okay. Sex one out of three. Like define sex. Like just the way the pixels look on these ladies. Like is that mature content two out of three? Like is that the syringes that you use to dope up? Like and why those three things to classify an indie game? Like it blows my mind. Um, Hobby Soft, you got you got to work on this because you had a good idea going, but you just it's it just didn't happen quite right. Uh, help the city of Oakland. Okay, apparently we were in California. By being the cool guy on the street to remove the evil mayor from office and get Oakland back to normal. This is a fun and funny standard RPG. But the mayor's evil? Well, spoilers, I thought we were saving him. Mm. Apparently it turns out to be evil. Anyway, that was Demo Doomsday. Two disappointments in a row. What else did you expect? See you later.